that to fail. Good morning. Another day here at Cerbello Farms. Today we are getting closer to harvest. So in preparation of that, we have to pull the onions that are ready. We have to cut the roots off. We have a machine that does that. Um, it drives through the onions and it cuts the onions at the roots, lays them on top of the ground so the tops can dry. But before we gotta do that, we have to move onions back so that there's a place for that machine to drive. Um, so that's all hand labor and that's what these guys here are doing this morning on every field we have to make a roadway for the pulling equipment harvest equipment you name it <clears throat> at this point we are done spraying these onions this is a different variety at that yellow flag those are not sprayed these are so yeah these are an earlier variety those are 110 day 115 day yellows and these are reds take a look at these really quiet this morning day three of doing this for these guys so guys are pretty tired it's tough work this here is our beautiful little crew leader Emmy she's the best in the whole wide world right Emmy hey. <laughs> <laughs> and yesterday was her birthday Happy yes, birthday, yes. Emmy! Yes, yes. Happy birthday, Emmy! Aww. Yes, yes. Well, uh. Mommy's way. So, boy, yeah. Okay. Get back to work. I'm not here. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And I'm not your dad. Yes, you are. But I'm a dad, you're my papa. Oh, uh, Pretty soon here we'll be uh, undercutting these onions with our onion puller. My uncle has actually got a project going on that. So we'll go see him at some point today. We designed and made this thing a long time ago and we're making uh, another improvement to it. So he's been doing that, looks great. We're going to go see it at some point here and you'll get a better idea of how that thing works. There it is. The polar in progress. Looks really good. Just got painted. Got some last minute things to do on it and should be Pulling onions sooner than later. Nice. Well, we finally got the polar into the field and here she is what we did was we extended this frame longer 
it'll be the other vipers and got a little prototype here a little deflector see what that does new paint job and she is pretty this is all custom built by my uncle every part of this minus the vipers and you know obvious stuff bearings and wheels and turnbuckles but this is all something that he did so pretty cool what you got here are onions that are still growing right there they got white roots most of them are pink what this does is the bar rotates goes underneath those onions cuts the roots flips them up on top of the ground as you drive through it and the fingers on the back right here these keep it a nice tight row so when you go through there with the harvester you aren't chasing onions all over the place keep the bed all cleaned up and straight well that's the intent here we go rain's gonna give it the first go I think those are offset. Oh. Let me drag it around and see what it does. Alright. Hold on. Let me put a couple more turns on the center lake. So it's pulling forward still. Gotta go up a hair. Right there. Yeah, now you actually have to push the back end down because the front end's like riding. Alright, let me do another. Okay. Uh, I don't know, man. Six and a half now. So, is your YouTube name Rain or Ron? I think both. Addison asked me the same thing yesterday. <laughs> oh no, 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 your name's Ron. <laughs> That's seven and a half? Both of these are, and those are six and a half. Ooh, you like that, Rocks? One handed. These are all different now. They look different. You look different. Yeah. Pull up to the scene with the seal missing. Pull up to the scene with the seal missing. I think we got to use our God-given talent. I wonder if, like, you have like a ratchet strap or something that you could like. That would probably be good. Put some pressure down on her. Couple more. That's close enough. Let's see. I want to see this thing get in the ground. Let's try it. Looks pretty level right now. Yeah, but level. Yeah, but it's living in the woods. Hold up a little bit. It's not doing anything. Is it rotating the right way? Turn it back on. It's rotating the wrong way. That's why it won't go on the ground. Hey, clean me up.
that is considered a fail. And yeah, head back to the shop. Our gearbox is not spinning the right way. It's a new gearbox. So, hey, you know what's gonna happen to us. We'll see. Back to the field, flip the gearbox over, just had it backwards. So, looks like things are working a lot better. As you can see, it got in the ground a lot more. Which, pull it. Let's pull it towards the track. It's just a little deep. Put a little more pressure on this bolter. Everything's pulling down into the ground. So we need to get probably back up to six and a half and bring the back wheels down. And then these things need to go way up. Because they're in, in the dirt too much, my little deflectors. Yeah, I'd love to just drop the quick hitch and see if the quick hitch is the issue. Yeah. We all didn't have a translator yesterday either. Take 22. Would you, oh, we just switch that. point hitch was probably holding it out of the ground if anything because it's pivoting on this front part so this needs to come back a bit and these need to go down to where they probably were was actually probably pretty good Six and a half. yeah great i'll see you up there okay okay moving top you want you Well, she ain't pulling straight. Well, she ain't pulling straight. Take two. Well, it's not pulling straight. I think it's in the linkage of the three-point hitch, or the mount of the plant, uh, puller, or it could be something we don't know. You know, maybe it's something different. You know. Events in the north. There was a really good song on before I shut my truck off last time. And yeah, didn't shut it off, didn't turn her down, didn't think ahead. Oh, well, let's go make some adjustments. Take 23. We took the telescoping ends of the three-point hitch apart and welded where the paw meets the end of it and hopefully this thing pulls straight. Turn. Feels better, but it's not 100%. It's 
It's definitely not great. Subscribe, like, and share for more videos like this one.